Housing has traditionally been the biggest expense for Americans, but health care is now a close second and in some cases surpasses it. Keila Johnson is self-employed and has to buy her own insurance. When she looked at premiums for 2018, she had sticker shock. If I had traditional, what I found out was going to be $2,600 a month. That adds up to more than $31,000 a year. With a $10,000 deductible, Johnson would pay over $41,000 out of pocket before her plan paid out anything. How could you afford that? Uh, we couldn't, and that's why I started doing research. She looked into Christian health sharing ministries like MediShare and AlliraCare. They aren't technically insurance, but the plans do offer extensive health coverage. Hayes Eagle with Blue Moon Benefits says what makes them different is members pay each other's medical bills. Whenever anyone pays their premium each and every month, just like traditional health insurance policies, it all goes into a pool of money. Whenever a claim is filed, they just grab X amount of dollars out of that pool and helps pay the claim that way. Deductibles range from five to $10,000 per person. And like the Affordable Care Act, there's free preventative care like yearly checkups, flu shots, and labs. They are ACA exempt plans, so that means there's no tax penalty at the end of the year. The plans are Christian based and include a morality clause where they can deny you coverage for certain things. Let's say if Someone's out playing golf with a few buddies, they have a few beers, and then they're driving home from that and they get in a car accident. They can decline that claim because they should not have been drinking alcohol and then driving their car later. Premiums, which are based on age, are much lower than traditional insurance, ranging from $142 a month for someone single up to $950 a month for a family. So how can these plans offer coverage for less? Because it's not considered insurance, so there's a few little loopholes, if you will, they can sort of get around. They don't have to have maternity coverage on everybody's insurance. I don't have to have maternity coverage on one of those plans. There's just a lot of different coverage options available and so they can just do it that way. Johnson's monthly premiums for her and her husband through AlliraCare are $600, not $2,600, and she's been pleased with her coverage so far. It's been a great experience for the beginning. One more thing to keep in mind about these plans is many of them have a limit that they'll pay for hospitalization. It ranges from 150,000 up to a million. Traditional health plans have no limit. In Clements, Kimberly Vanskoy, WXII 12 News.